Right, a quick demo of a traditional style mouse trap. Now, when I say traditional, the pictures of this I've seen are pretty much exactly the same as this, but instead of using screws, it's like wooden dowels or whatever, and the string was kind of like old style plaited cordage, whatever. And the main back piece was made out of one log which seemed to have been split in half and then this kind of square section carved out of it. But essentially this is the same. And I'll show you how it works and then what I'll do I'll see if I can explain how I've made it. What you would then do is you want to put your bait here or right at the back there so the mouse or whatever stands on this plate. So all it essentially is is one bit, I've just done this one roughly, one bit at the bottom some sides in the back just some side bits screwed on I've done these roughly but you could do this better if you wanted to and the actual spring mechanism for this part is just a piece of double, a looped over piece of string and then it's just wound up one side wound up the other side you have to wind it equally because if you, if you wind it one end it pushes this across and then it jams against this side so you have to wind one then the other wind one then the other the trigger you see there's a nail in here but this is just loose because this needs to move this needs to move like this so you don't want it solid and that's got a hole there and there's been a slight part cut in there as well and then you just get this nail and that just loosely goes in there but enough for this to still still move and for this to still move around as well little notch there Imagine how much power you can get in a bit of coiled up string. Oh, and that's the only other thing. It's got a notch cut all the way along here and along the top for the string to sit in. As you can see there, a notch. And then this is rounded off slightly and then a notch rounded off slightly. You could pop, you could, from what I'd send, it would take quite a lot of time and effort to just catch a mouse but you probably from the pictures I've seen of this you could make this in the woods with you'd need a few tools you might need a saw an axe maybe some chisels and stuff like that but if you was a pretty good woodworker you could make that from just wood from in the woods but alternatively this is a quicker easy way of doing it with just little planks of wood you know there's no real skill to it it's just knowing where to put the bits and just kind of common sense you have to have this bit raised up so that you can get this bit there but if you have the sh you may be able to get the string going from there to there but actually you probably could you probably could just go straight down maybe maybe or maybe level the same level And obviously the looser, uh, the looser this is here, the more easier it is to go off. So bait at the back, or somewhere along here, 
and then that's your traditional style mouse trap. Alright, cheers for watching. I'll see you later.